Thanks so much for staying with the McAllen Cable Network. I'm Roxanne Lerma. Well, with this cold weather, it probably doesn't feel like it, but spring is right around the corner. And with that, well, Arbor Day. Joining us now, Miss Chris Lash, our guru over at Keep McAllen Beautiful. Thanks for being with us. Thank you for having me here. So we have our Arbor Day celebration. I mean, it seems like blink of an eye, it just happened, but it's coming again. So tell us about it. Yes, this is actually our fourth annual celebration. And the whole objective of this event is actually to focus on the importance of trees and to try to educate all our participants on the benefits of trees. And so we have a 5K, a 10K, a 25 mile bike tour, and we also have a bike race. Now these events you can participate in all of them if you can or in just I one don't know of about them. all of them I, I'd be happy with one of them <laughs> yeah, we actually have for those that do not run that aren't runners or are not bikers we actually have a family fun walk also and that's always a lot of fun because you see families coming with their little strollers and their children and they take that walk on along the hike and bike trail and what we want to do is have a, um, a quiz there for them to uh, show them and educate to them on the importance of trees and identifying trees because a lot of times we see trees we don't see or we don't know what type of species right. they are and so they get to learn about that and we're also going to have a tree planting that day and we will be giving away a hundred trees Roxanne okay that's a big deal yes for the little kiddos when they're participating in an Arbor Day celebration like this how do you think it brings it home to them, Chris, how important it is for us to take care of our environment? Well, you know, it's an experience for the children because a lot of times families do want to run, walk with their kids. Mm -hmm. And so it's a fun event for that, but also showcasing trees is something that's important to everyone because a lot of times we don't recognize the benefit of trees. We don't realize they provide, you know, uh, that support against the air pollution, they provide the oxygen we breathe right and you know it's it's things like that that we need to um, let children know and understand because we want more trees we want more trees in McAllen in the valley we need to increase our tree canopy and so this is a great way to expose your children to that and to learn more about that so they can all kind of hang out together and participate in a tree planting well, if they would like to stay for the tree planting, they can do that, mm -hmm. or they can participate in our events. The events start at 7 in the morning, okay. so the run will take place at 7, and we have a circuit that is actually going to take the 5K and the 10K participants through a neighborhood that has a beautiful tree canopy. And Gives so, them an idea yes. of what they want to be. <laughs> yes, and so um, they can participate in that, or we're also simultaneously, we'll be taking a group of uh, whomever wants to go help plant trees will be planting some trees in a park or in a public space and so we'll be doing that as well. Okay, um, if they want to know where it's going to be, when it's going to be, or if they want to register, where do our families go for information? Okay, all the information is on our website which is keepmcallenbeautiful.org. Not com. Dot right. org. Dot okay. org. Or, uh, you know, some people would rather have a paper registration form. Uh -huh. We have those available also. They'll be available at Valley Running Company and at Bike Masters McAllen location. And so they can also obtain a paper registration. And we'd like for everyone to register early, of course. And um, this event, again, takes place on Saturday, March 7th. So we want to make sure everybody has ample time to register for our event. 7 a.m. 7 a.m. Okay. Um, is there a fee associated with our 5K, 10K bike, walk? Yes, and actually the fees vary depending on what event you're doing. So, for example, the 5K is $15. It's very reasonably mm -hmm. priced. The bike race is $25. And so um, it's an event that um, is a course where we're welcoming anyone. I mean, we're, we're also inviting people. If you're in a wheelchair, you can even do our course awesome. and so we're actually inviting anybody who would like to get out there and just enjoy the weather and being healthy and so it's a great way to be sustainable okay so speaking of sustainable and our Arbor Day celebration I mean it takes a lot to kind of put this together so we've gotten some help in that department 
We have. We've actually gotten great sponsors this year. We've had HEB come in as our title sponsor, which we really appreciate mm -hmm. all they do for our community. Right. Um, we have, you know, Rio Bank is participating. Bogus is participating. We have great um, participants and sponsors, so we really appreciate that. And we have a great board, Keep McAllen Beautiful Board, and the committee that's putting this together, of course, it's business people in our community community, you know, Hedemann from Valley Running Company, Jesus from Bike Masters, they give of their time, you know, they're totally volunteering right. to help put this event together. And so we um, really appreciate this event coming together. It's going to be a lot of fun for any age. You know, whether it's a child or whether it's a grown adult, the elderly, I mean, anyone, this is an event for anyone and everyone. Fun for all ages, for yes. the entire family. Yes. Is there still room um, if someone is at home and maybe says, you know, I'd like to be a sponsor for that event? Absolutely, yes. We definitely could, could use that additional sponsorship. You okay. know, this it takes a lot of money to put this event together with all the supplies and everything needed for it. So we absolutely welcome sponsors, of course, course, we also need to give the runners water, you know, fruit, bananas, oranges. So, you know, if anybody can sponsor, that would be really great. Okay, so we want everybody to go out to March the 7th, uh, McCallum Municipal Park. Correct. Okay, Miss Chris Lash, thank you so much for joining us. And we certainly hope that you're going to mark that date on your calendar and join us for our Arbor Day celebration. For the City of McCallum, I'm Roxanne Lerma.